Every little thing I pick on him. Every little last thing. You put the milk on the middle shelf when it's colder at the bottom of the fridge. It belongs on the bottom. I've told you and ten times. Put the crazy. milk on the bottom of the shelf. It's just right. And, the and, milk and, is yeah. going to go bad. I know. I, uh, yeah, right, right. And, and it's not that she's wrong. The problem is, it's the same thing I said at the intake yesterday with the end. She's not wrong. It just drove me crazy. It was like right. the little soap had to go in the middle of the little thing that went on the top of the other little thing that went at that angle, not that it's angle. It's like and you I'm have to get myself, it exactly right in some way. Why in the hell does this make any difference? And I realized that it does, but emotionally for me, it was like, this is driving me nuts. Mm -hmm. and, and yet I couldn't say, as with the example of, of the milk or anything else, it's not that she's wrong. It's not like this is just some insane thing that she invented like we're going to hang the milk outside to heat up just to see what the hell happens she's okay. right i mean i do i do tend to do those things because they're not really very important to me part of that is good grief i'm going to be stuck with this old man who's sickly and isn't even going to take his medicine mm -hmm. you know i'm going to have to be like i have in the beginning of our relationship, I felt like I had to be his mother, remind him about this, remind him about that. And I told him I didn't get married to be somebody's mother. I want to be your so, partner. I want us to yeah. be equal partners. So here all of a sudden it's, you know, fighting the same thing. Oh, Lord, I have to be his mother. He forgets his hat. He for Never, I don't know, maybe once he's put the cream on when I finally... So it's I have to almost have a tantrum for him to take care of himself. And when you feel like you have to have a tantrum, that's when you start to kind of close off and go farther away yourself, right? Because no, then you get that angry spot that you don't want to bring that energy into the relationship that we were talking about last week, right? And you'll go away. That's when I see yeah. how it's hopeless. And I, it's mm -hmm. hopeless. Right. When I, oh God, he's out without the hat again. You know, and he, I already told him the other day, guess what? There's a pimple there where I first saw the first one. There's... No, you know. So some sense that... If I didn't care I, about him, right. let him get skin cancer. Right. Screw it. I don't give a damn. Let him let right. him die. Right. It's like I'm, I'm pointing those things out to him because he matters to me. Because I want us to be together. I want, I want us to work it out. Yeah. Right. And then he has other medicine he doesn't take, and he has to run to the bathroom every five minutes because okay. he doesn't take the medicine. So, he that. doesn't. He doesn't renew the prescription so, for days. So, That's not. Let's, well, it's yeah, a let's, different let's medicine, maybe. Down. Let's slow this down a bit because the complaints then start to come. Like the list gets big. It's, yeah. It's all part of and the as same. The list, right. It's the same pattern, right? But as the list gets bigger, it doesn't feel like it's just the so much the pattern. It feels like it's more you're getting more and more uh, dug in in some way, right? Or the pile's getting higher and higher.